Welcome to a new space. I'm so excited to be in a new space, a new area. I extended my stay in Paris because first up, I, I love Paris and I don't want to leave. Second up, I got a really exciting opportunity towards the middle end of month. So I thought I'd stay for that. The plan is to go to Barcelona after that. I need to tell you about this space. I'm staying in this gorgeous studio in the 10th, 10th? In the 11th, arrondissement in Bastille. I had a very chill morning. I went to Reformation Pilates in the Marais. I booked it on class pass. I wouldn't normally book a class that kind of fancy, but I have some credits to use up. Did the dishes, I'm just gonna make myself a coffee. So Julia has a coffee machine over there. I don't have paws, but I still have my my trusty instant coffee, which I've been drinking every day this month. Absolutely not sponsored by Nescafe. Um, but she doesn't have a kettle, so I'm just gonna boil some water on the stove in the good old fashioned way. Et voilà, c'est parfait. and execute. That is, to explore what is really essential, to eliminate what is non-essential or less essential, and then third, to build a system that makes execution as routine and effortless and easy as possible. I've been listening to Greg McKeown's Skillshare class, Simple Productivity, How to Accomplish More with Less, where he discusses the mindset of essentialism, which is basically choosing to do more of the right things. So more of the things that matter to you, more of the things that you value. This has been a super interesting class to take as someone who is I guess working in a creative field, he was talking a lot about the importance of discerning between the work that genuinely excites you and the things that you agree to as a people pleaser, which is one of my lesser traits. I definitely have a hard time saying no to things. The Skillshare have such a huge range of classes that you can take from ones that are more hands-on like fine arts, photography, illustration, all the way over to like productivity and entrepreneurship. There is so much range and definitely something for everyone. So if you're looking to start something new this summer, I highly recommend getting on Skillshare. You will be able to access the full range of classes for free for one month if you use my link in the description. The first 1,000 of you will get access to that. So be quick and I hope you enjoy. For the rest of the afternoon, I want to explore my new neighborhood. Um, there's a few coffee shops that you guys recommended to me. I want to check out a few of the vintage stores, markets. I don't know. We'll see what I get up to. This song has been stuck in my head all day. I can't stop listening to Lana. Got ready. Here is the fit. Top from Mumi. One of my fave sustainable brands. Jeez. Six for walk-up. Let's go.
raining in Paris, but something kind of comforting about it. And I have a lot of work to do today, so it will force me to be stay inside at least. This is my current work from home setup. Just want to try and finish this video. Watching myself edit. <laughs> Narcissist vibes? I don't know. just quickly got ready. Um, I'm actually going to get my hair cut, finally. It's giving not a lot at the moment. Maybe some layers, some face framing bangs. I'm gonna ask them, but I'm going to this place called Me and Marae. I think it's a Korean hairdresser. It was recommended to me by some of you guys, so I trust. But it is still raining outside. And I gotta walk. That's okay though. Je comprends français, mais je ne parle pas bien. Oui, aucun problème. Je pense que c'est ça. Sinon, on mélange. J'aime. Oui, j'aime comme ça. D'accord. Avec des des gradés. Oui, oui. Je sais pas les. Les ya, les ya, les ya, ça va du coup. Les ya, c'est les ya. Alors, je te fais confiance. Confiance. Merci beaucoup. I'm home. I walked home, so it's blown out a little bit, but got my hair cut. The sweetest people ever work there, I would 100% recommend. The lady who cut my hair, I actually didn't ask for her name, but she was she was so nice. She reminded me of my mom. And I was practicing my French and she was really sweet about everything I was saying and all my mistakes. I had this image that I showed her on Pinterest and yeah basically asked for longish layers i was considering getting a fringe or like a wispy fringe i might just keep this for the time being and then see how i feel after a few days honestly not that dramatic i just like how clean and better my I hair like that this space uh, gets oh my god i woke up to sun on my face here and then it just kind of travels along onto the balcony and then it goes all the way because I'm in the top floor because all the way over through this window and then we get evening light coming in through here and can watch the sunset which is just so special it's Saturday my period started this morning so my tummy's tummy's kind of sore feeling kind of lethargic and bloated and hard to concentrate so I just spent the past um, hour finishing Demon by Herman Hesse. When we hate someone, we are hating something that is within ourselves, in his image. We are never stirred up by something which does not already exist within us. The things we see are the things which are already in us. There is no reality beyond what we have inside us. That is why most people live such unreal lives. They take pictures outside themselves for the real ones and fail to express their own Actually, lovely experience. 
was kind of busy because it's the first of the month, so museums are free for everyone. Um, but there were some lovely paintings. His studies, or his version of Le Déjeuner sur le by Manet, was so amazing to see. There's also this etching, the Minotaur one, which I wrote an essay about in second year of university. And it was really cool to see it in real life. It was, yeah, it was super sick. But I don't know what I'm gonna do now. I thought it was gonna be raining. I mean, it looks super great outside, but so far, so far so good. But they do a 10 euro like meal deal so i got the aubergine quiche and this cookie and then just like a ginger lemonade look how fat that is she also gave me the biggest size it's so good i don't know what's in it but it's so good 